nice is it to have two functional hands? I've been playing with two broken hands. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm sure it's, no, it's good. I feel good. Send me a picture, Jer. Just excited to be back up there. How, how did you do that? How did you and, and perform well given that limitation? Uh, honestly, didn't really, didn't really think about it much. I think, uh, you know, when you got when you got a purpose to play for, like, play for the team, and, and you don't think about yourself, it's, you can do anything. And so it's like, you go out there and no matter what, it's good. You love playing with those guys out there, so. Yeah. Tommy, you seem to take to your one or two balls pretty quickly, maybe faster than others. Mike, where's Keith? Is there still a difference for you? Having that under your belt going into year two? Oh, okay. Do you feel the understanding is different now than it was in your day? Well, I think it's it's just different um, on different levels. Um, so, um, you know, first year is first year, but second year is you try to uh, learn even more about the defense. Uh, you know, really try to get into his brain and, you know, why is he calling something? Or, um, you know, how, how the whole defense works. Does it allow you to do more things, maybe not you specifically, but the defense as a whole? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, just from like experience, uh, you know, second year in the defense, I think, um, you know, um, you know, I think just that experience helps a lot um, from that first year. What are your expectations for the defense as well? We've, uh, we've we have a lot of expectations. We kind of keep them to ourselves, but um, you know, I know they're very, very high expectations. You don't try to be a guy who individuals and public ones, but are there things that you want to accomplish individually? Uh, I say, uh, you know, I, I think everyone kind of has individual goals, but um, you know, I don't really, you know talk about them, I'd say, or, you know, tell anyone, but I'd say team goals definitely come first and defensive, too. Jim Noel said that he can yell at you and you'll yell back at him, which yeah. he likes, right. because that, that candor, that honesty. Yeah. And he was trying to add that major matter. How important is that for you to feel that you can challenge a coach and say, why are we doing this or what's going on here? Mm -hmm. How important is that? I think it's really important um, because I want um, – you know, he knows how the defense should work. Um, and um, just, I think, like, as a player, you kind of think you know, but you really don't know. Um, so it's nice to, you know, bounce off the I, off, you know, ideas back and forth. Um, so that's good. Tommy, what was the most fun thing you did this offseason? Uh, we got to go on the Buckeye Cruise for, uh, for cancer. That was so. in February, man. Come on. <laughs> that was really fun. Uh, yeah, that's that was probably it. Well, you just have this reputation for being all business. I was wondering if you have any questions you like to do in the free times. The celebrity software game was fun. Okay. Not celebrity, but you know, Cardell's. Well, you're a software game. No, um, but celebrity, <laughs> I mean, Cardell's was really fun. You ever worked the farm with Kate? I, do, I have not. I've been there up there a couple times, but I um, haven't worked with them. Haven't bailed in there yet? Not yet, no. Tommy, what can Sonny do for this defense this year? I think Sonny can do a lot. Uh, you know, he's, uh, you know, he, he's smart, he's, he's strong, he's big, he's, he can play football. Um, I think that, that allows you to do a lot of different things. So, you know, I'm really looking forward to him playing. CJ Hicks, what, what does he bring? He's a great player, too, just like Sonny. I mean, smart, knows the defense really well, you know, strong, fast. I mean, he can, he can do a lot of things. And I'm, I'm really excited for him, too. Yeah, it seems like y'all have, like, Several guys you can just slip into the lineup that kind of changes the look of the of the defense, right? Does it feel like that too, Tom? Yes, I agree. Yeah, and uh, have you used the joke for what yet? Yeah, uh, who has two uh, Who has two heel thumbs uh, and has a smile on his face yet? Yeah, I have not. I, you know, I don't yeah, know that joke. No, yeah. I you know what I mean. You can have that one. Oh, okay. Yeah, I would. Yeah. I was just trying to give you some information. Uh, <laughs> one day, you, you personally. What, do you get the sense that everybody around you now gets the Jim Nose defense? I mean, what, yeah. How does that show up out there? Yeah, so I'd just say, um, you know, hearing the, hearing the checks that, you know, everyone makes and um, the confidence that everyone has out there, um, you know, it's, it's a good feeling. So it's verbal. I mean, you're hearing it verbally that people yeah. know what's happening. It's verbally, but it's also, I mean, when we watch film, too, it's, you see you guys understand it. After spring ball, you said you'd like to have, ideally, like 11 Tommy Eichenbergs running around. How many do you see out there now in terms of knowing the defense? 
I see 11, yeah. When people say you are the leader of the defense, what do you think of that? Uh, I think it's, uh, I mean, it's, it means a lot uh, hearing that. Um, but, you know, I know just about every, every single person, you know, on that defense is a leader. Um, so. Tommy, what, what was more impactful to this team in the offseason and preparation for this season, the second half against Michigan and the fourth quarter against Georgia? I'd say second half versus two and north. Um, you know, if, if they don't score a point, you know, they don't win a game. I mean, the same thing as Georgia, too. Um, you know, if, if they don't score, they, they can't win. Um, so I think we really took that to heart. Is, is there a feeling that in, in, in either game, you kind of let one slip away? Absolutely, you know? yeah. yeah. I, Go ahead. Hey, Tommy. Uh, <laughs> Dylan, too, uh, I'm speaking for Russia here. Uh, if you did play football, what do you think? What sport would you be great at? Uh, baseball. 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 Like, we're talking shortstop, third base. Uh, pitcher. Yeah. Pitcher? Yeah. Because he made the pitcher softball game. Yeah, D yeah. That's a good one, too. Thank you, Tom. Yeah. Would you throw junk, or would you be throwing uh, uh, inside fastballs? What would be your pitch? <laughs> Knuckleball, actually. <laughs> Sometimes it doesn't require a thumb. Yeah. Yeah, you can. good.